All right then, you lot. Um, if you asked me if I saw this one coming at the start of the window, I'd have said yes. But if you'd have asked me ten minutes ago, I'd have said, what are you talking about? Nah, you'll stay. Harry Vaughan's gone out on loan. Now, I get on. I get on really well with Harry. I think a loan move is a good thing for him, judging by the minutes he's had this year and that kind of thing. But it's, it's not one that I saw coming, to be honest with you. Like I say, if you asked me ten minutes ago, I wouldn't have been able to tell you anything. And I wouldn't. I would. I'd have said, "Nah, you, you're watching." Um, anyway, we'll read City's statement. Bristol Rovers haven't yet put one out. But it reads, young midfielder Harry Vaughan has signed for Skybet League one side Bristol Rovers on loan for the rest of the season. The 19-year-old has appeared 15 times for the Tigers since signing for Oldham Athletic, initially for the Academy last January. The Republic of Ireland Youth International joins a Pirates team sitting in 11th place under Matt Taylor with 37 points from 28 games. We wish Harry the best of luck for his uh, spell at the Memorial Stadium. But, um... Yeah, look... I said on the run up to, in the run-up to the window, I think a loan move for Harry is a good thing because he's not got the same minutes. Well, he's not got the minutes he's probably been hoping for this year. Uh, there's still no statement from Bristol Rovers, by the way, which is a strange one. Um, have, we, have we jumped the gun on announcing it? Um... Have a look, let's see if it's just their website not uh, not updated. There we go. Um, there's an announcement tweet. Um, it's a really, really good Photoshop. I'll give them that. But, um, yeah, so I think it is a good move for Harry. Um, shame to see him go out. I thought he'd be here for the remainder of the season, to be honest, but... I, He's got a future here, uh, I think, and let's hope he can really, really kick on because I thought when he started the first game at Norwich, he'd be, um, you know, straight. He'd be picking up the same, you know, how he was last season and playing every week. Then he had a little injury and then he's just not been able to get back in the team. But I do think this leaves us a little bit light. Because we've lost Cynic, Alia and Lakila this window. But losing Harry Vaughan as well just seems... Yeah. Seems a little bit of a strange one because it leaves us without many natural wingers. Philogene, Zaruri. And that's it. So, I mean, Harry Vaughan isn't really a natural winger either. But he's more of a winger than two fannies, for example, or Cavalio. So we'll see, how, we'll see where it leaves us. Still no statement from Bristol Rovers, so I'm going to leave it there and get prepared, hopefully, for Anas Zaruri on the hour. Thank you for watching, everyone, and good luck to Harry. Take care.